Okay, have a look at this here. Um, this is me sitting in a car. I'm trying, I'm trying to get to work, but along the way, there are three sets of traffic lights. Now, the, the probability of it being red, um, is 0.6 for, for, for this traffic light here. The probability of it being amber, 0.1. Probability of it being green is 0.3. Okay. Um, this, this road here, it's um it's a lot busier than this road here so the so it's more it's more it's most likely to be red by the time i get here whereas over here it's only 0.2 um and uh, I, so so this this road here is really busy whereas this one here i'm more it's more likely to just let me drive through okay and uh, but by by the way um amber re well red means stop so so when you're driving if you see uh, uh if you see red you're supposed to stop and amber means stop if it's safe to do so. Okay, uh, green you can go. Basically, both of these actually amber actually means stop, um, but uh, only stop if it's if it's safe to do so. But let's for for our case, let's just uh, let's just uh, let's just merge these two together to create 0 0.7. So 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 you basically have to stop. Okay, so so amber actually means stop. So uh, well anyway. So um so I'm driving along uh, along and I'm I'm going to meet three sets of traffic lights. What is the probability of me having uh, only having to stop once? So I can stop. Uh, well, uh, it's going to let me through, let me through, but then I have to stop. So that this is a good outcome. Uh so uh the stop through through. So well anyway, what is the probability of me only having to stop once? So um press pause and uh, and have a go. Um, remember with probability you 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 you're trying to draw a map of all the things that could happen. So try and the hardest part is to draw a map. Once you've once you've drawn your map, um uh then then it should be uh, plain sailing after that. Um but think how you would draw a map. How would you represent this situation as a map of what we're trying to do? So so uh, press pause and think about it. Okay, so again, we are trying to draw a map. Now, imagine you sitting here. Okay, you are here at the moment. You drive along here, and then, and then, what could happen in here? You could, uh, you could either stop or go. Remember, remember, we are we are merging these two together. So, so the the probability of stop is uh, 0 0.7. And the probability of go is uh, is 0 0.3. And then you, you're driving along here, and Again, you could stop or you could go. Again, here, stop or you could go. Okay, so so bear that in mind. So let's let's try and represent that. Uh, so you are here at the moment. So the first, you drive along here. Okay, you could either stop or go. So let's let's try and represent that. So stop, go. All right. Uh, so so probability of uh, stop will be 0.7. The probability of go is 0.3. Now, let, let's say you you stop uh, on on your first one. Then then you then you drive along, and here you could either stop or go, stop or go. Okay. Let's go back to the beginning now. You are here now, so you drive along here. Let, let's say you 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 headed down the go route, and then you drive along here again. You could be stop or you could go. So you could represent that like this: stop, go. Okay. All right. Um, so 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 now you could stop, stop, and then uh, well on, on, now we're on our third one now. We could either uh, stop or go, and then here we could either stop or go, and then here stop or go, and then here stop or go. Okay. Um, so, so now try and identify which branch, uh, which branches we're interested in. Uh, we are interested in, well, only stopping once, stopping once, well, stop, stop, so that's already a bad thing. So stop, stop would be bad, full stop. Okay, so, so it would be stop, go, go, so this is a good outcome. Well, stop, stop, stop would be a bad outcome. Stop, stop, go would be a bad outcome. Stop, go, stop would be a bad outcome. Well, anyway, stop, go, go would be a good outcome. Stop, uh, sorry, go, stop, 
stop. It would be a bad outcome. <clears throat> um, uh, go, stop, go. This is a good outcome. Go, go, stop. Good. Uh, go, go, go. This is a good outcome. Now, the thing is, the probability, um, it, it, well, well, now, now let's, let's look at the, uh, the second set of traffic lights here. So we, the probability of us stopping would be 0 0.3 because we're going to merge these two together. Okay. 0 0.3. And the probability of the, of us going would be 0 0.7. 0 0.7. So here it would be, um, uh, stopping would be 0 0.3. Going would be 0 0.7. Now, third set of traffic lights here. Our probability of stopping would be 0 0.6. 0.6 probability of go would be 0.4 okay so again this would be 0.6 0.4 0.6 0.4 0.4 okay so um so well bad outcome here bad outcome here bad outcome well we, this is a good outcome so let's let's try and tackle this so this would be stop go go now we need to stop and go and go so remember if it's an and you uh times if it's uh or then you add okay so so we need so we need probability of uh stop uh go go so stop go go so that would be uh stop would be 0 0.7 times uh well we need this and this and this so it would be 0 0.7 remember this is 0 0.7 this is 0 0.7 and then we need uh we need go so this will be 0 0.4 0 0.4 so that um well we we we, we oh, let's let's jump to a calculator uh calculator hang on so um so it would be 0 0.7 times 0 Point seven times uh naught point four equals uh naught point one nine six. Let me double check. Uh yeah. Okay, so um so now we so so th this one this one here is done. Okay, now we've got to look at this one here. Uh go stop go. Alright, so hang on. Uh go stop go so that would be well go here would be 0 0.3 times uh the stop here would be 0 0.3 times the go here which is 0 0.4 okay so jump to calculator uh clear uh 0 0.3 times 0 0.3 times 0.4 equals um equals 0.036 so uh this one's done this uh this one's done this one's done uh now we need go go so um so probability of what is it go uh go stop that's what we need go go stop so this would be go here would be 0 0.3 times uh go here which is uh 0 0.7 and then times stop stop here would be 0 0.6 0 0.6 equals jump to a calculator um clear uh 0 0.3 times 0 0.7 times uh 0.6 equals uh 0. what 0.126 okay now the last so, so this one's done the last one uh the last one is go is go 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 this one here okay so hang on so probability of go 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 equals uh equals uh 0 0.3 times 0 0.7 times 0 0.4 so 0 0.3 
times 0 0.7 times 0 0.4 equals uh, calculator, uh, clear it, uh, 0 0.3 times 0 0.7 times 0 0.4 equals uh, 0 .0 0.084. Okay, so, so now looking at this, we need this branch, we need, well, we need, it, it could, it could have to have this branch, or this branch, or this branch, or this branch. And when it's an or, we need to add them. So we gotta add all these together. Okay, so we gotta add all these together. So, um, so probability, well, you gotta make up something here. Probability, uh, only once. Only, once uh, equals equals well let's let's get a calculator and add that add these add these four together okay so uh, calculator clear it uh, 0 0.196 plus uh, 0 0.036 uh, plus uh, 0 0.1 Two six plus uh, 0 0.084 equals equals uh, 0 0.442. So uh, let, hang on, let me double check. Yeah. Okay. So so the probability of me having to stop only once would be would be this. Okay. The the thing is, once you've drawn your map, you can answer a lot of questions. So, um, you, if someone asks you, what, what is the probability of not having to stop at all? So it would be go, go, go. And, uh, uh, so, so you would get this times this times this. So, uh, what is the probability of having to stop twice? So, so stopping twice would be stop, stop, go. Well, uh, it, it depends if, if you want to define this as stopping twice. Um, if, if I say, oh, what is the probability of stopping exactly twice? Then, uh, then this, this, this will be a bad outcome because I said exactly twice. <clears throat> so, so it depends on the question. Well, my, my point is that once you've drawn a map, you can, you can answer a lot of questions. You can say, well, what is the chance of you, of you stopping twice here? So it would be uh, exactly twice. So, so it would be th this, this, this. So this is a good outcome. And then go, uh, stop, stop. This would be a good outcome, and so on. With, with a map, you can you can answer a lot more questions. So so always try and draw draw a map just to just so that you can see what's going on inside your mind. Okay.